Hope in Motion, formerly known as Relay for Life, hosted their annual event this past Friday at the University of Wisconsin Eau Claire Zone Arena. The annual event, which raises money for cancer patients, brings in family members of cancer survivors, the survivors themselves, and community members as a night of hope. Jessica Warner, the president of Colleges Against Cancer, a student-run organization on campus, said the American Cancer Association was no longer able to sponsor the event, which led to a name change. Along with the name change, the event was held in Zorn Arena for the first time after being held at the McPhee Center annually. Warner, who says the event brings in around 250 to 300 people a year, didn't expect the location and name change to hurt it. I think it definitely did have an impact for semester. Um, our organization has been fundraising for the Marshfield Cancer Center all year. And so we kind of tried to lessen that gap of information, like misunderstanding. Um, we had our name out there. We talked about um, why we changed our name. So I don't think it's going to impact tonight. I think tonight's going to be a great um, event. And we still have about the same amount of participants as we did last year. It just took a little longer for us to kind of get people to sign up because they didn't quite understand the difference that it was the same event. Warner said the fundraiser raised about $14,000, which had been slightly less than past years due to the loss of sponsorships from the ACA. Brianna Prock, a member of the CAC, came up with the idea of keeping all the proceeds local. Brianna's mother, who was a, a nurse but passed away from cancer, was a large reason why she chose the Marshfield Clinic Cancer Center in Eau Claire. I actually, outside of this club, I was raising money for a room to name in honor of my mom at the Marshfield Clinic Cancer Center. So as an executive board, we decided that we would help raise money towards my mom's room, but then also raise money for our own Hope in Motion um, room. So we thought that having our own room in a local hospital would be a really cool uh, part for our club. And that way all the money stays local um, and helps out local patients. The fundraiser held different events throughout the night that included a ceremony of first lap for all cancer survivors attending, various organizations with booths throughout the Zorn Arena, the luminary ceremony, and activities that all participants could enjoy. Every year the event has a theme. This year, Warner said Dr. Seuss was the chosen theme because of the many quotes from Dr. Seuss that embodies the hope of change. Warner said she wants Hope in Motion along with other nationwide cancer fundraisers like Relay for Life to be a beacon of hope for cancer survivors and families. This event is amazing. It honestly brings so much support and it's a support system for not only college students because the reason that our members are in this club is because they've been affected by cancer, but also when we reach out to the community and we get survivors to come to this event, it shows that the next generation cares. We, want, we don't want them to go through this and they're not alone or anything like that and we just want to honor them and know that they are supported. From Inside Eau Claire, this is Seth Abrahamson.